exciting news. The 2025 model year could be the dawn of a new era for the Toyota Corolla Cross, with potential jaw-dropping updates. A sleek new front face fascia and high-tech interior upgrades are on the horizon, promising to elevate small SUVs to a whole new level. The burning question is, will these thrilling updates make their way to North America? The anticipation is palpable. Don't miss out on the potential unveiling of what could be the most revolutionary SUV of the year. Before we delve into the details, make sure to hit that subscribe button for all the latest car news and reviews. The 2025 Toyota Corolla Cross, a unique SUV counterpart to the popular sedan Corolla, stands out with its higher ride height, increased cargo space, and all-wheel drive. It's designed specifically for the value-oriented small crossover SUV buyer. All models will feature a single engine option, a 2.0-liter naturally aspirated inline for producing 169 horsepower. Since its global debut in 2022, the Corolla Cross has remained largely unchanged. But an update is expected for the 2025 model year. Notable updates in other markets include a sleek integrated grille, a new body-colored hood edge, and redesigned headlight units with sequential turn signals. The interior will boast a digital instrument, cluster display, and larger infotainment screen. However, it's still speculative if these updates will be available in the US market until Toyota makes an official announcement with the 25 model. So how is the 2025 Toyota Corolla Cross to drive? Here's a rundown. The Corolla Cross is silky smooth and reliable for everyday use. Our all-wheel drive version we tested inched from 0 to 60 miles per hour in about 9.6 seconds. Sure, it isn't a speed demon. Actually, it's pretty much average for its category. City driving isn't too bad in the Corolla Cross. It does well on daily commutes, but sometimes you might just want to think things through on the highway when passing. The steering and braking in this SUV have been modulated for comfort, not sporty handling. So if what you are going for is something zippy, this may not be it. Under its hood lies a 2.0-liter inline four-cylinder engine churning out 169 horsepower, although that may arguably seem modest compared to some competition. It's at the torque end where the engine shines. You get a good deal of low-end power that aids in launch acceleration and makes city driving more enjoyable. How comfortable is the Corolla Cross? This 2025 Corolla Cross by Toyota should be comfortable enough for daily commutes. Most of the road jolts are absorbed by the suspension setup and the journey remains smooth. However, they can be a bit soft and consistently uneven surfaces to give a somewhat floaty feel. The front seats are well padded but might lack thigh support for taller drivers. The back seats are agreeably reclined, but with overdue legroom, so taller passengers may find the experience disadvantageous. You can be a little disturbed by the road noise on the highway. The climate control fan is a little too loud on high settings. Other than these very minor quibbles, the air conditioning does its job quite nicely, keeping the cabin cool on some of the hottest days, supplemented with rear air vents for added comfort. How could the interior be? Well, the 2025 Toyota Corolla Cross symbolizes a well-thought-out cabin that feels spacious in most areas, except for rear legroom. It's still tight, primarily against peer smaller vehicles like the Hyundai Kona. Ingress and egress are easy with this practical layout. The 8-inch infotainment touchscreen is a masterclass in modern design, intuitive and user-friendly, incorporating functions such as Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, which facilitates smartphone connectivity. These materials have been constructed to be hardy inside the cabin, although some users will find them a bit useful. However, the Japanese giant has improved things a little by increasing the premium feel and adopting an ergonomic approach to interior design that ensures the placing of controls within easy reach. More advanced features include adaptive cruise control, lane keeping assist, and automatic emergency braking, which improves safety and convenience. The 2025 model year will bring a range of sleek exterior updates to the Toyota Corolla Cross. The new front fascia features an integrated grille and body-colored hood edge, enhancing the car's cohesion and style. The updates continue with the new headlights, which feature a sharper design and sequential turn signals, adding a pop of style to the front end. The Corolla Cross's dramatic and sporty flared wheel arches, along with new wheel designs, give it a fresh, robust appearance. 
The rear end is both practical and stylish, with integrated steps for easy cargo access and optional tow hitch provisions. These updates not only enhance the car's appearance, but also add practicality, making the Corolla Cross a stylish and functional compact SUV. How's the tech? Even with regard to its technology, the 2025 Toyota Corolla Cross truly steps up. The base 8-inch touchscreen is spacious and modern, but can lag, particularly with navigation alongside voice commands. Fortunately for Toyota, their upgraded models will bring a larger screen of 10.5 inches for a little sleeker operation. Plugged into the system, both Apple CarPlay and Android Auto make hooking up your smartphone easy. It has incredible things in the Toyota app, including remote start and phone as key, but these all become subscription-based functions. Advanced driver aids keep you safe with adaptive cruise control and lane keeping assist on board. Stereos are JBL branded on the higher trims and have very good sound. Storage? Well, plenty is going on for the 2025 Toyota Corolla Cross. The square feet you have available in this all-wheel drive version really helps with groceries, sports apparatuses, or that oversized weekend duffel bag. A wide rear opening allows easy loading and unloading, even if those back seats don't fold quite flat. It's inside, though, that Toyota really has managed to make life easy. From door pockets to a center console bin and loads of cup holders, there won't be anywhere you won't be able to place your water bottle or your phone. The narrow lower door opening and limited legroom in the rear do make fitting bulkier child safety seats just a little fiddly. One cool feature is its towing capability. It can handle up to 1,500 pounds with the Corolla Cross. That isn't huge, but it is pretty respectable for a compact SUV. Whether you're hauling bikes or a small trailer, it gets the job done without a fuss. How about fuel economy? The EPA rates the all-wheel drive Corolla Cross at 30 miles per gallon combined, a hair above the norm for the segment. The front-wheel drive variant manages to do better with 32 miles per gallon combined. Our test car returned 33 miles per gallon on our highway-heavy mixed driving loop, so the EPA rating seems within the realm of possibility. The 2025 Toyota Corolla Cross could be a big refresh in the lineup, making its more stupefying presence within the small SUV market. Sure, with areas of excellence like comfort, fuel efficiency, and storage, this vehicle will also have to improve in other aspects, such as driving performance and rear legroom. Watch for official statements from this car maker to find out whether these updates will indeed be offered here in North America. Thanks for watching. What do you guys think about these rumored updates coming for the 2025 Corolla Cross? Let me know in the comments. If you like this video, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more car news and reviews.